The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made, made heaven, heaven and, and earth. earth. We say together, Most, Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. Alleluia. Before the ending of the day, Creator of the world, we pray that you, with steadfast love, would keep your watch around us while we sleep. From evil dreams defend our sight, from fears and terrors of the night. Tread underfoot our deadly foe that we no sinful thought may know. O Father, that we ask be done through Jesus Christ, your only Son, and Holy Spirit, by whose breath our souls are raised to life from death. Psalm 104 Bless the Lord, O my soul, O Lord my God, how excellent is your greatness! You appointed the moon to mark the seasons, and the sun knows the time for its setting. You make darkness that it may be night, in which all the beasts of the forest creep forth. The lions roar for their prey, and seek their food from God. The sun rises, and they are gone to lay themselves down in their dens. People go forth to their work and to their labour until the evening. O Lord, how manifold are your works! In wisdom you have made them all. The earth is full of your creatures. There is the sea spread far and wide, and there move creatures beyond number, both great, small and great. There go the ships. There is that leviathan which you have made to play in the deep. All of these look to you, to give them their food in due season. When you give it them, they gather it. You open your hand and they are filled with good. When you hide your face, they are troubled. When you take away their breath, they die and return again to the dust. When you send forth your spirit, they are created and you renew the face of the earth. May the glory of the Lord endure for ever. May the Lord rejoice in his works. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. Revelation 22, verses 4 and 5. The servants of the Lamb, shall see the face of God, whose name will be on their foreheads. There will be no more night. They will not need the light of a lamp or the light of the sun, for God will be their light, and they will reign for ever and ever.
Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into, Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, Alleluia. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide, Hide me under, under the, the shadow, shadow of your wings. Alleluia. The, the Lord is risen. Alleluia. As he promised to you. Alleluia. Alleluia. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory, glory to, to the, the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. Alleluia. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. As he promised to you. Alleluia. Alleluia. We come to a time of intercession and thanksgiving for the day. Father, in this day, a day of blessing and challenges, of opportunities and confusions. Father, for the things we have done today, for the things of the blessed, we give you thanks. For the things that have perhaps not proclaimed your name as we wish, we offer our remorse for the people we blessed and for the people who have blessed us. We thank you, Father, for the news that has cheered and the news that has made us weep. Father, we lay that before you now. For those we know who need a touch from you, for Kevin and for Lizzie, for Ronnie, for Keith, for Vic, for those who love them and stand with them, for George and for Paul and for those who stand with them. Lord, we bring to you today, tonight, those we know who have needs and we pray for your presence in their lives, that you would be good in their lives, that you would be God in their lives. Yes. And we pray for those who watch, who pray, who weep, 
the loved ones. We ask that your spirit would be on them and that your presence would be not just surrounding them but lifting them to the heights. Yes. We ask this, Father, in your most glorious name. Amen. Amen. Father, as we come to the end of this day, we thank you for the prayers and the praise that's been offered mm. in your name today. For those who have gathered together virtually or any other way in order to give you praise and in order to share together from your word, to share together the bread and the wine, to remember, Lord. remember the sacrifice of your son to rejoice in the knowledge of his resurrection to remember together that we are called to be witnesses mm. in our words and in our lives especially in this time of challenge. Father, may we rise to that challenge. May we rise on the wings of your spirit. May we be filled anew, invigorated anew, enlivened by his work in our lives and Lord may we never cease to praise you may we never speak, cease to speak of you may we never cease to live for you Father, as we come to the end of the day, we thank you that we know you have been with us, that we know you have visited us and you continue to be with us. Lord, as we go to our beds, we thank you that the sun rises in the east and your praise will continue, your people will continue to lift up your name. So, Father, we can sleep peacefully in our beds, thankful for the many blessings. Mm. Father, when we wake in the morning, may we be enthused again to live for you Lord in your mercy hear yeah, our Lord. prayer God our Redeemer you have delivered us from the power of darkness and brought us into the kingdom of your Son. 
grant that as by his death he has recalled us to life, so by his continual presence in us he may raise us to eternal joy through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. And so we gather our prayers together as we say the words that Jesus taught us. Our, our Father, Father in heaven, heaven hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make, make us dwell, dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for, for the, the night, night is at hand and the, and the day, day is, is now, now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so, so do we look for you, O Christ. Christ. May the risen Lord Jesus bless us, May he watch over us and renew us as he renews the whole of creation. May our hearts and lives echo his love. Amen. Amen. Thank you for being part of this with us tonight as we go to our beds. May you have a blessed and peaceful night. <laughs>